On a first glance, when I look at this guy, I think of uh, Krasikola with Malachite. Other associations I expect to find from this deposit, uh, being the Kolwezi mine, relatively new uh, deposit to my uh, understanding, uh, would have been coming... Well, I received these goods in uh, uh, maybe July 2021. Um, so it, it, it's most likely a relative pocket and one of the things yes mining in the Katanga is ongoing but the guys mine through various sections now I'd expect them to avoid this section because they are mining for copper and this is a, a, a solid Krasikala matrix so the copper content here would be very small so mining wouldn't be economically viable on this particular section so maybe the guys opened it extracted a few specimens and carried on with their mining elsewhere anyway we have a solid matrix of krasikola which would be the main body of the specimen on closer inspection you'll see telltale uh, uh, of the krasikola you'd have cross uh, a patterning on the cross section and this would be stalagmites and stalactites of the Krasikola. And forming on this and uh, uh, graying into it are almost floaters of malachite. So these formations you see uh, sitting on top, the green formations, they seem to look rather black, but they are actually a lovely dark green, as is typical to, to, to malachite. Um, would be bladed formation of malachite, perhaps malachite after or maybe got replaced by uh, or replaced barite. And uh, uh, if you see little yellow crystals, I don't see any at the moment, that would be yellowish to beige, maybe inside there would be some barite. Also, other associations I expect to find from this particular pocket would be a uh, shadow cut i don't see any on this so here what i see at the moment is malachite and krasikala so malachite perched on the solid stable krasikala matrix no chalcanthite associated here